In this video, we're going to focus on how we can stack multiple bars on top of each other and make sure that only the very top has a rounded border. So let's start to look how we can do this in Chart.js 4. So to do this, the first thing what we need is our border template, which you can find here on chartjs 3com getting started once you're on here. Copy this chunk of code and you're good to go. Next, if you want to have the source code of this video and many others, check out my Patreon page. And of course, got a question, put it on Discord. All the links are in the description box. So for this case, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get three data sets. Let's copy this and paste it two more times. So put a comma paste, comma paste, and then let's give it a independent color. That's the first one. We'll say here, this is the black sales, oh, black. And then we have another one here, that's the blue. This is the blue. And finally, we have the red sails here. Let's see there. Red. And just to make it sure, we have some differences. There, there, there. Safe. Here we are. All right. So we have these differences here. I want to stack them all on top of each other. So I'm going to say here, x, comma, and then stack equals true. Copy, copy that paste here save refresh all right so what I want to do here eventually is to give the very top a border radius so what I can do here is we can say here border radius and oh sorry not in here that's my bad what I want to do is I want to put in the options because I want to apply all the settings to every data set so I don't have to repeat them multiple times so what I'm going to do here, border radius, and let's say a top left, we'll make it 10, and then top right, we'll make this 10 as well. Save that, refresh, and as you can see here, they're being applied on all of them. So what I want to do now is to make sure that we're going to skip the border from the middle part. So it will be intelligent enough to understand that these two should be a square or rectangle shape so i'm going to say here border skipped set this on middle comma here save refresh and there we are now we have all of these here you can see here it covers it nicely and everything else leaves it as it is and that's basically it